just a quick run through, quick video of the uh, Eurider Model 75. It's a lovely bike to ride and look at. Got the uh, extra lights at the front that have been added. Got the uh, box at the rear, included the padded, including the padded seat. Useful for the pillion. It's got uh, obviously very clean. Never used, never used in the rain. So the front, let's have a look, we can uh, turn it on. Can't really see the display in the light. It uh, shows 1223 miles so far. We've got um, two storage boxes. This one, you've got some extra LED lights for the, the, the daylight running ones. Uh, I've got a switch here as well, which I was gonna fit in onto here. Um, that's just for the extra lights that, that were fitted. At the moment, they're currently running off. I have to come around. You can, you can see they're on there at the moment. But they're running off this. If I open it up, there's a switch just built into here. So that's just to turn them off. On again, you can have flashing mode or off if you want to be an emergency vehicle. That can I say it's also got uh, USBs, two USB sockets, really handy. Charging the phone and anything else you needed. Um, under the seat, let's have a look at that. Off. Got a lot of storage under the seat, nice. I love the sprung loaded as well, so it's got the stays up. It's got extra charging, extra long charging cable. It's got the original tool kit in there. The seat cover that came with it. Um, it's also got some mitts. I'll include those. And I've also got, which I'm including as well. The, this is a leg cover. If you do go out in the cold. It was very useful. Um, and what I did realise, I've got this replacement lens. And it was delivered. They put a very slight mark. That was the guy who delivered it, so I got a replacement. Uh, I was going to fit it. It's easy to fit. It's literally just two screws underneath. This pops off, and then this pops out. You literally, it's just the lens. Thought I'd leave that one. You to do that's a nice easy job, and then uh, I think that's it under there. I think access to the fuse if you ever need it, you can isolate it. Um, and that's it. Oh, you know, what a beautiful bike! I've enjoyed it. Uh, one thing I forgot to show is just the uh, the motor running. Let's see. Give that a spin up. Some rapid acceleration. Nice braking. Very smooth. Shows you this, you see it might be. And of course on the controls you've got um, Obviously there's the reverse, so it's a case of you're going forward but you press it to go reverse and then it's backwards, obviously very slow speed. You've got your three speed control, I'll just leave it on two, you can switch it one, two or three, so literally two takes you up to 60 miles an hour nice and, nice and smoothly. That's about it.